uh, there's many clinics uh, in the world right now doing stem cells, some form of stem cell therapy, uh, with different methods, with different styles, different uh, kinds of cells. The ones that I'm using uh, are the it's an autologous uh, stem cell, which is coming from a human placenta that's not the patient's uh, cell, uh, which is for me the best because you you're getting all fresh new information uh, with these, these cells. So uh, it's from a human. It's from after the baby is born, so there's no harm done to anybody. The baby is a healthy baby. It's or naturally through a C-section in order to avoid contamination of the tissue. Uh, but um, uh, the tissue is collected, it's studied right then. I personally take the samples, the blood samples, or the placenta samples uh, to the lab myself. So I'm very careful about that part. It tested for everything that you can think of that could be transmitted um, in with the best possible way with the, with the uh, polymerase chain reaction test for the HIV, which rules out 100% of positive cell HIV transmission. Uh, it's the syphilis, toxicosmosis, uh, cytomegalovirus, uh, herpes, you name it, everything is checked. Uh, and after everything is clear, then it's processed for, uh, for implantation in a special lab that I, that, I, that I have, which is GoLab. Um, later on we'll have a web page about golab.com. Um, so uh, this is the method that I'm doing and then I decide if some forms of this method were used uh, years and years ago uh, in Europe and in other countries uh, the only the thing that I added was you know the methodology the, the, that I changed the protocol and I, I tend I do customize it according to the to the patient's needs and, and that's that's if I can say I uh, created or invented something, it was that. They were the design um, of uh, this uh, particular methods that I do for particular conditions uh, according to the patient. They might even vary in the same condition with the same pa in different patients. So, so that's my, my contribution. If I can say I did something, it was uh, my contribution was to design these new methods and protocol, protocols of, of treatment for different conditions. Um, and you will see, uh, as uh, as we show in all these different web pages that we're designing for different conditions, uh, um, all the specifics of the of the method for a particular condition. Uh, there's other methods out there uh, that are uh, in the market, uh, as we as we call it, uh, that are involved other 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 techniques. Some people ex uh, choose to. Uh, deliver uh, the cells intravenously, I don't like that method. Some people do it more aggressively doing intratectally in, in the, the spine, I don't like that method. Uh, sometimes uh, they do it inside, the, they do try to inject the cells in particular areas of the brain, I don't like those methods. And why I don't like those methods? Because the possibility of, a, of, a, of a, um, uh, inflammation of the area, the possibility of an, of an infection of the area, encephalitis and myelitis, uh, even the microembolism that you get from having uh, a bunch of cells injected in your in your vein that go ends up in your lungs, and uh, and I don't like that um, that particular method. I'm doing it subcutaneously, and I think it's the most uh, effective way since uh, uh, the body has time to absorb it, has time to explore it, has time to to adjust to it, and time, it has time to use it because it's slowly uh, reabsorbed by the body. So uh, I prefer that method. Uh, and I, even though I, even though I have a chance to do, to do any other or the other, I, I stick to this one that I've been using for 18 years and without having any side effect from besides the local inflammation that you can get in the uh, in the area. Besides that, I have never sent anybody to a hospital, never in around 3,000 cases of patients that I've seen. I've never sent anybody to another doctor because to deal with the side effects of, of this method. Uh, thank God I haven't done that. Uh, and, I, and, and that's why I keep doing this method because uh, it's safe, it's reliable, 
is I'm getting results, which is what people want. Um, people don't care too much about the method, uh, uh, but the result that you would get from it. So, um, so if you have a fast, safe method, and then you have some results with, from it, without having to risk anything else, and uh, so that's for me. It's the, that's why I continue with this method. Um, um, the um, also the uh, finances of it is is uh, are very interesting because uh, it's is an affordable one. As people. Even though it's not cheap, it's, it's affordable for, for most people, uh, and I like that also to work because some methods are extremely expensive, and uh, this is not a case like this. this is not the case with this method. There's other methods where that where they uh, use your own stem cells uh, from the bone marrow, um, and there's pr it's promising. Uh, stuff of those some people don't like that it's your own genes the same genes the same the same old cell that you've had for with the con with your condition uh, some people like it uh, I still like the um, the autologous which is the uh, method that I, that I use for it all the time um, there's no risk of teratomas or these tumors that they, that you can have if you try the embryonic Cell. The embryonic cells considered to be the one that's before eight weeks of the pregnancy. I'm totally against that. Uh, I, don't, I, don't, I don't think we should mess with and kill any human to help other humans. Uh, so that's my principle. I, I'm totally. In some countries, are using the um, embryonic stem cells. Embryonic stem cells uh, have been used for research. Uh, have used, uh, they are trying to do some of those methods for, for therapy in humans. Uh, in my case, I totally disagree with that. I don't, I don't like the idea of uh, killing a human to help other humans. Uh, and, with that, and they're doing that. They're killing the embryos or getting cells from an embryo to help to research and or to try to heal somebody. Um, I think that those methods are going to be decreasing and uh, you know are going to be failing